I think representation speeds up the process. When I think about the amazing pioneers and our communities and people we know, I always call it the dinner table theory, which is if you take white middle class people and maybe their kids end up going private school, whatever it was, right? And let's say they had traditionally two parents and let's say both of those parents worked in jobs which were over 50, 60, 70K, whatever. The type of conversations that child would have around a dinner table, or even if they're not part of those conversations, what they would hear puts them in a position, a much stronger position to children. I've seen the confidence, I've seen how they step into things, the vocabulary, the understanding about things. You just pick this stuff up. Whether they follow in their parents' footsteps or not, they are getting a level of intelligence and capital which can then maneuver into different spaces and different sectors. When I look at my own children now, and I can bring them around entrepreneurs and investment bankers and footballers and musicians, faith leaders and politicians, and this is just normal to them. And I say to them, that person does this and this person does that. And it's not always about money, but it's worth you knowing how much that person's worth. My 11 year old and my eight year old and my five year old, that level of capital they are beginning to understand will set them up in a nice way.